Oh hey there. My name's Super Ken for Super Ken Gaming, and welcome to SK Storytime. To sit back, relax, and let me put you to sleep with my sultry, beautiful voice. Gotta give you. Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I I didn't realize I was getting this weak. This is his food, so what I do you give want? A handout? Oh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. Forget that old man, though. He's not getting any food. Here, eat something. You can have... the jerky. Thanks, Lee. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for All a right. bit. Go ahead. Use it. Here you go, Mark. Here, Mark. This should help. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to give me nope. the axe? Come Don't on, hurt your Harry. limber Cut back. Some slack. He knows you're just out to protect Lily. He told me so. Just like he's trying to protect Clementine. He... Oh, I just need some food. Going this long without a proper meal make anybody cranky. All right, two people get to eat. She doesn't want any. There you go, duck. I'll give you some crackers hey, too. Hey, duck. Just because I feel food. bad. Just <laughs> no. There you go. Here. I'll give yeah. Kenny the apple. Oh man, I'm so hungry. Apples are very apples are a very good source of energy. But I need I need the energy. I gotta look out for myself because I have to take care of Clementine. But I am I I can't be super Ken in this situation. I have I have to think about the long term in a survival situation. And I am important. I'm important. Simple as that. I need to keep my strength up too. I use that apple for my energy. It may it may seem selfish, but I have to survive. Not such an easy job, is it? Never said it was. I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Lee, Kenny, I know I ran out of food before. Hey, it was a tough choice, but you took care of the kids. That's what a real man does. Right Thanks, here. Kenny. Right in the heart. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. It's fine. You're out! What happened to my food? There's none left. You keep treating people like this, and your days in this group are numbered. You're one to talk, old man. Yeah, well, I don't see you working on that wall. True man, Super Ken. Grizzly beard. Ken, Lee, come here, please. He didn't make Take it, did he? Take my sumo He vitamin. lost too much blood. Extra God food. damn it. I'm getting sick of this He's shit. testosterone. Ken, come back. There's nothing... Uh... Let him go. Let him go, Katja. But... He just needs time. It's been a rough morning. That man no brought, place, man. I tried, but he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. What about the other kid? The Knock my socks off. Uh, oh! He was bitten. It's very difficult for me to do with one hand. Oh, you guys tell me he was bitten. Why didn't I ask if he was bitten? Shit, it's stuck! Shoot 
I was wondering you what okay? I just did. Yeah. Thanks. Why'd you Take bring him here in the first fruit. place, That's asshole? Right. Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all Can killed! And it was that time. Why didn't you tell us he was bitten? What? He was bitten, and you didn't say a goddamn word! But he wasn't bitten, I swear! Then how did well, he... Your not-bitten friend here came back to life sick? and tried to kill my wife! What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does it. What is it, Ken? You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to so all So he of died? Us. Uh... We're all infected? We're all infected? Everyone? I... I guess so. What? I don't know, I... All I know is that I've seen people turn who I know were never bitten. When I first saw it How happen, did he die then? We were all hiding out in a gym and everybody thought we were finally safe. Maybe he bled to death? But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. Ooh. A lot of them. Suicide. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and God. Back off! Whoa, lady, relax. Me and my brother, we we just wanna know if y'all can help us out. I said back off! Carly. Mm. Are you armed? Are you armed? Yeah. F for protection. Dead could be anywhere. But, uh, I think you got the upper hand here. Why do you need gas? I know these guys are armed. Our place is protected by an electric fence. Ooh. Generators provide the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look. We own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. Need that food. Y'all be willing to lower your guns. We we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. Lee, why don't you and Mark check we the place why. out to see if it's legit? We don't know why. I know I'm going with you. Got plenty of food. I got your back if anything seems fishy. So, uh, what do y'all think? Um. Okay, we'll go to the dairy. You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. So, this dairy, you guys really have food? Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. I'll just pretend like I don't know what's about to go down. It's nice to get away from that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. Um, Lily is a smart leader. Lily's way of running things is smart. It's not easy, but it's keeping us alive. Or maybe you just don't want to be in charge. Well, not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of Gotta build past. the trust. Does anyone else know? Um, Larry knows. Larry knows. Great. That can't be easy. Clementine might know. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore. Maybe store. if I take leadership. Ask me about it. Leadership to her, but... That'll force trust. What exactly did happen with the senator? Uh, now is not the time. Now is not the time. I don't know what happened. Well, I'm here whenever you want to talk. Sometimes well, I wonder if I should talk to the I don't want to say it was an accident. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Straight up. Not sure everyone would see it that Killed way. Killed the fool. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I, uh, really appreciate that. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? Mm hmm? I grew up in Macon. I grew up in Macon. Right here in the heart of Georgia. That's what I like to hear. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor inn. Uh, who's running things over there? Lily. Oh, no. We'll say it's a democracy. We work as a group. All of us looking out for each other. I hear that. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. He gets it's it. just stupid. How many people you got over oh, there, geez. anyway? Um, 
Nine including the kids. Nine including the kids? You forgot Ben. Me? That makes it ten. Well, we'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy for well, as long as I can remember, but now it's... You getting... think you're going to cut me out of this? Shit, get down. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always oh, puppies. Bandits. 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 Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided man. my camp. Who are they? Shh. Fuck you. Fucking you knew we were hungry. So... You guys were keeping it There's up. There's only two of them. Yeah, and you know oh, what? We ate it all. Good for that Don't worry. Danny and I got you covered if something happens, but let's just wait this out. I hope they move on. Oh, Fuck took you! A shot. Now's your chance. Headshot, no scope. Fuck you! Fuck you! Jesus! Asshole. The world out here has gone to shit. Yes. Let's get to the dairy where it's safe. Survival changes the fool. That crossbow, though. Why don't we go back and take that crossbow? That's what I would have done. But I'm me. I'm different. Here it is. St. John Family Dairy. <laughs> Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The fence keeps them out? You betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. Yep. Hmm. Have any accidents? Ever have any accidents? Nah. It's safer here than out there. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John, and welcome to the St. John Dairy. Well, this here's you, Lee. Lee. He's from Macon. A couple of our old farmhands were from Macon. They grow them good. Jamaican. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? Uh, we work together. We all work together. Plus, we've got plenty of people with military experience. Well, that's good to hear. That motel ain't the safest place. Now that y'all are here, we'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. Um, we're awfully hungry too. <laughs> We're awful hungry. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this well, morning. thank you. Amazing. Those Can't get stuff like that anymore. Scrolls. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's right. Hopefully Maybell will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? What's she... We have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks out. A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered! Maybe our whole group could come for the day. Well, how Good about idea. this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Sounds Danny, good. why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take Ben. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along yeah. anyway? Take, take care of ben. yourself, please. Nobody wants Ben around here. Mark, Lee, why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. This place is incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Oh, man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? Hmm? Let's make sure this place is safe. 
Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Right. Obviously they think it's safe. But is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Not a big deal, but maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. And checking the fence perimeter? Sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. All right. I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. Let's go talk to Andy then. Which one was Andy? Hello, Andy. Hi. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. Been stockpiling, huh? Mm. How many weapons do you have? We've scraped together a good supply in the last few months. How about yourselves? What kind of protection do you have around here? We collected a few guns to protect ourselves, but we really only use them when we go off the property. When we're inside the perimeter, the fence is all we need to keep us safe. Um... Let's go fix it, then. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. Fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it's overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy northwest. enough. Northwest. Stay attentive. You never Left. know. That is all for SK Storytime today. If you want to see more, make sure you subscribe to the channel because I'll be back putting you to sleep every day of the week at 10 p.m. Eastern Time. Thanks for watching.